Another feature with the iComfort S30 is the ability to quickly set up and program or modify schedules. To first do so, let's wake up the iComfort. And now let's go ahead and click the Mode Schedule button to see our options. Clicking on the Schedule icon allows us to see our preset schedule options. A schedule IQ, a summer schedule, a winter schedule, spring and fall, or a save energy schedule. Let's take a look at them and see what they do. Enabling one is as simple as just tapping the button and it switches to the schedule. But let's see how easy it is to edit the schedule to our custom settings. So again, we'll click Mode and Schedule. And for this example, let's talk about Schedule IQ. We'll hit the Edit, edit Schedules button. And we can see that it has some preset values. It asks us what time we're home and what time we wake up, and what time we're back at home and we go to sleep. What time we are away and what temperatures we want it to be when we're away. Modifying the schedule is simple. Simply tap on the home day and change the time. So if we wake up at 6 a.m. or perhaps 615 We've now set it that when we wake up at 615, the heating mode will be set to 67 degrees and the cooling mode will be set to 80. Let's say that if we wake up at 615, we want it to be a little bit cooler. We simply put our finger on the button and drag it back. Or if we want it to be a little warmer, we put our finger on it and drag it forward to increase the temperature. Now, at home, we set our time that we go to sleep and we can do the same thing. We can adjust the time accordingly simply by dragging the buttons around. And we can change our set points simply by sliding the circular buttons to the left or the right to increase or decrease our set point. And now you'll notice on the away function there is no time with it. And that's because Schedule IQ is going to utilize a smart away. And Smart Away is set up on your smartphone so that when you are in area of the home, it knows that you're home and reverts to your normal schedule. But as soon as you leave, it uses the geofencing in your phone to notice that you have left and reverts to your away settings. You can then set the distance for the geofencing to work, and when you get within that range, it will notice you're returning home and revert back to your home schedules and set points. And again, it's just as simple as dragging the buttons to your desired set point. This really makes programming the digital thermostat even easier. And with Smart Away, having the ability for the system to know when you're home or when you've left, it makes it even easier to save energy. Now let's take a look at some of the other schedules. For example, the summer schedule. We can look at all days, and we can see what our set points are for different periods of the day at 6 a.m., 9 a.m., 5 p.m., 9 p.m. And we can modify that time again simply by tapping on it and changing the time. And then we can change the set points for that time. If we know we're in bed by 10 p.m., we might set the heater back to a 62 degree set point. And we might raise the temperature of the air conditioner up so it's not wasting as much energy. Or if you like to sleep a little cooler, you might even lower the set point so you sleep a little bit cooler. Now you can do the same with each time period and select what programming set points you'd like. We can also come to the fan icon in each of these schedules and decide, is it on, is it auto, or is it going to be in the circulate mode to where when there's no call for heating or cooling, the fan continually runs to move air across our indoor air filter or our purifier to keep the air quality in our house within range. We also have a preset winter program, spring and fall. And another thing we can do within each program is instead of editing all days, we can hit the day option button 
and decide, do we want to program each day individually? Do we want to program the week to be the same and the weekends to be the same? Or do we want to program all days at the same temperatures? So for example, let's say we wanted to be able to control each individual day. We would select it and press OK. And now we can see our set points for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And if for some reason Thursday we're not home as much, or if we know that's our day that we're out of the house for work, we can increase our set points to save energy simply by sliding the indicators around. We can also do the same thing with selecting how the fan operates within each period. On, auto, or circulate. And we can select the mode, whether it's going to be fully automatic with heat and cool, heat only, or cool only. Once we click OK, we can go back in. If we've programmed it and we're uncomfortable with the changes it's made, hitting the simple Restore Default button in the lower right-hand corner will restore it to all the factory program defaults so that you can get back to where you were before or find another spot to reset it. Another option you have while looking at the schedules and editing the schedules is the ability to remove one of the time periods if there's just too many changes during the day. Let's say, for example, that you leave for work and you simply don't come back home until the evening. Well, you can come to the afternoon or the early morning period, and instead of changing the time, simply delete the period, and then it knows that you're home at 6, and you leave and you come back at 5, and you can set your programming. Now, if you accidentally delete a period and you want to add that programming period back, again, simply push the restore defaults and put everything back to its factory operational setting. If the names don't mean what you need or they don't meet a naming convention that makes sense to you, it's as simple to change them as hitting the rename button and changing the name from spring, fall to whatever we desire and all the interface is done right through the on-screen keyboard. When we're done, we can simply hit the Home button and go back and then select the Mode button to decide which mode we want to run in.